Okay, you might wonder why I have uh, immersed my gauge set in water. This is something I do usually at the beginning of the cooling season to see if there's any leaks. Now I'm going to get a little closer on here. Uh, there can be leaks up here in the gauges themselves. I've had this happen before. And there can be leaks at the hoses where they hook up there. That looks uh, it's pretty good. However, one little spot here. Okay, that uh, hose has got a leak. What I've done is if you look here, the gauge set has pressure in it, and that's simply because I have it hooked to a refrigerant cylinder. Uh, what we're doing, of course, here is by putting these hoses there, we are finding out if there are any leaks in the hose, and we certainly do have a hose leak. That's the high side hose and that hose needs to be replaced. You should be looking at all these hoses very carefully at the beginning of the season. And if you got one hose leaking, you're going to have to assume the others will be leaking pretty soon. So go ahead and replace the entire set of hoses. Uh, check your gauges, be sure your gauges are working okay. Uh, maybe easier just to replace the entire gauge set.